morning uh welcome back so we got a lot of new people and i want to just uh kind of give them a backstory on me so my name is brandon i live in the great state of alabama it's uh it's getting getting finally it's getting fall ish out here um nothing real special i've uh, been scrapping for for some time and i uh, just found a five dollar gopro at a yard sale and started making videos um other than that that's really all i am as far as <clears throat> things that are upcoming um the trailer still is supposed to go in and do some work he supposedly ordered some things for it so we'll be taking it back in at some point this week he's gonna give me a call also uh p.o box that's basically done i gotta go pick up the keys for it and uh that should be in the description uh, with this video hopefully if not the next one for sure um, also I gave kind of a list of things I would recommend if you're gonna start scrapping minus like what kind of camera I'm using which is the GoPro 8 with a head mount simple stuff um, that's just things that that I think you kind of need um, just go through the list pawn shops are really good for that so are yard sales what else my wife is working on all the social media things. I, I don't even own a Facebook myself. I, I'm just not that type of individual. I don't, I'm just not that type of individual. So what we got planned for the rest of the day is uh, we went out yesterday on Sunday and we, we did some scrapping, found some things. Um, I did check the dryer for some, some miscellaneous stuff that may be in it, just some lint. I think I found like three, three cents. So that's good to go um check the hair dryer thing just kind of done a, a, a i'm kind of spoiling the video for people but yeah y'all get what i'm saying um checked everything i had a lot more and a few little pieces like the computers i found in a few videos back i went and tore them apart they're on here so it's not a super great load but it's good enough to go so we're gonna take it we're gonna see what she weighs what she pays and uh yeah it's kind of the uh the, the agenda for today um i have some questions about maybe an aluminum run some copper this that and other. i don't have a ton of copper so i won't be doing a copper run just yet my wire bends probably half full by now so that's that may be a thing the aluminum i wanted to get like a whole trailer full and i just don't have that much yet but with the trailer about to get some work done we may do an aluminum run just with the pickup I think we can we can manage that so stay tuned i mean it just really depends on kind of how the stuff flows we have some severe weather coming in this week that's a thing too that's on my mind just got a lot of stuff going on just a lot of things on my mind so uh i hope you're enjoying the videos um if you're not subscribed consider it it, it really does help help us out and get up there i mean we're close to four thousand, and uh let's try to hit that mark and we'll go from there and uh yeah i'm on the way to the scrapyard now to get this dumped off and see y'all in a few minutes got a few things here um what all is it is it all scrappable material definitely looks like it's scrappable material to me it's got ants all over it though hey ants leaving the stuff alone gonna have to make two trips don't fall well there's your ant bed right there just a quick glance on the inside All right, I like it. Don't know if these are plastic or, or tin. We're gonna take a look and if... Uh, maybe aluminum actually. I have no idea. Yeah. 
Yeah, looks aluminum to me. They can go back here. I hadn't found a lot today, so. Strange pieces. Yeah, that'll be fine for right now. We want to go about our business. Get out of the middle of the road. We got a little bit more metal here. I guess I should put them in the back considering they're not really steel. But, I haven't really had a... Some more dog dogs. I haven't really had a huge eventful finding a million pounds type day so yeah oh my magnet <laughs> my magnet shattered into a hundred pieces so I got plenty of magnets yeah all that's gonna be aluminum probably more than likely it sure looks like it doesn't it it's good I need to get aluminum run soon so and it looks like I might be able to clean them up by just maybe taking these screws out. I don't know if they'll get me clean with the paint on them anyway, but we'll see. Well, that's the thing. They look in good shape, too. I mean, okay shape, right? Mm. Those are not bad. So I guess I'll just put them back here with the bad stuff. Somebody put gum on that one. That one looks like somebody got hit over the head with it. So that one. That one may go through the scrap pile if it's too bad of a shape. But everybody needs folding chairs, right? All right, well, not too shabby. Chair was trying to be camouflaged a little too well. Two chairs, I guess one was camouflaged with the other chair. A chair day again it's another chair day just called wife on those she wants to keep them she said that uh you know we may have a get together or something and need some chairs so those already found a home my home all right got a vacuum i don't know what else is in the box cord's been cut what kind is it it's a eureka what else is in here? What are you? It's hot plate. It's hot plate. TV bracket. Pieces of a TV bracket. Paint. Can thingy. Um. Alright, well. Take a look. That's about it. Um, come on. Nah, I only got one hand, really. So we'll take it. It's about to go in the uh, in there. Oh, somebody actually put a plastic tray in there, I guess. I was wondering why it looks so funny. I don't know what the purpose of that is. All right, well, we'll take what we get. So we have a dry. Um, chairs and the aluminum things went back. There where they belong. 
the uh, let's take a look at what we got. Got a dryer. It's got a little water in it. So well, we're gonna put it right here on the back of the trailer so that way I can look on the inside. Nothing too special, right? Slow walk up. Perfect. That uh that helped load out today. <laughs> we'll take it. Well things have shifted around a little bit, but I got a grill that's gotta come on here, so it's gonna have to reshift itself. There's Tony's. Sorry, we call squirrels Tony's. My daughter made the name and it just kinda has always stuck that way. But we got a grill. It's gotta find a new home. So, it's definitely a much welcome because uh, as you can see, it's not exactly a ton up here. What I'm probably just gonna do is Kind of toss everything to one side, push the dryer up here. And uh, I just stick it right here for now. Got a grill, I just moved everything over, pushed the dryer back. We're gonna put it right here. Oh. Well, we're not gonna talk about that, are we? <laughs> we will say this about it, and then we'll leave it at be. I got the money out of it. Man, that thing's paper light, like, without having all the racks in it, you can definitely tell. Well, all right, that works. Now this has some weight to it. I've got a few of these before and they're not the, they're not the lightest things. They're uh, the cast iron benches and normally they're broke or something. This one actually does not feel that heavy. I'm wondering if it's actually aluminum. Aluminum? It's cast aluminum. Now that, that changes it a little bit. That's going to be a lot lighter. Still got some good weight to it though. Have to take the bolts out, get cast aluminum prices. We've got a small piece, nothing over the top. what we have just yet what is it I'm still kind of lost a hairdryer is that what these things are what's in there I don't know I don't know I'll take the light though somebody's already cut the cord on it I mean definitely somebody's been down through here but they didn't cut the cord on this What's this go to? What kind of alien contraption is this thing? Up here, remember? I'm not going to destroy this yet because one, I don't know exactly if it's worth anything or what it's really for. Therefore, I don't want to just tear something up, assuming. Guess I'll take this because it already wants to come out. Y'all don't break. Y'all play nice. Okay. Sure. All right. Another air conditioner. 
that's something. What about you, air conditioner? Are you in good shape? Will, will you still work? Is what I'm asking. Is what? She can go back here too. Y'all play nice too. Huh? Starting to get dark when we start finding things, right? That's, that's, that's par for the course. Um, Some weed eater parts. Pole saw that somebody tried to put a new carburetor on it. That's telling me that it's it's garbage. Um, guess we can look in the briefcase. Oh, that's empty, empty. Well, I mean, we'll take the weed eater parts, right? grill here he's bringing something else up down so i'll go ahead and grab this and we'll go on about our business all right let's get this off so we checked this i had a lot more that needed to go the computers i tore apart just some miscellaneous stuff that uh needed to go and it's gonna go today um wasn't nothing out here this morning uh, same route as Sunday's route, so be expected maybe. They're ready to go already, so he's gonna grab it. basketball goal is from a few videos back too so you know time for it to go as well I think that's it let's go see what it weighed what did she weigh and what did she pay she weighed 560 pounds and she paid 50 dollars and 40 cents not bad for picking up someone else's trash and turn into a few dollars now i had the lawnmower that was a bit different the computers came from from um from a pickup too so realistically it's not bad 50 dollars for uh for Sunday's load. I didn't find nothing today. I did go around today though, just to see if someone threw something out. Like, nothing. That's how it works. You know, you can't always make the the, the million dollars. But uh at any rate, we're gonna I'm gonna go grab some breakfast for my wife and uh and yeah. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If uh if you actually enjoyed the video, you know, give it a thumbs up, share it to one of your friends and uh, maybe consider subscribing um thank you all again y'all are truly awesome people and uh see you on the next one bye